Thank you all for coming. Um, today's obviously announcement that 2019 will be my last season. Hey guys, Luke here, we need to do another video. This time we're going to be talking about Cooper Cronk and the fact that he's announced his retirement for the end of the season. I don't really know what to say about Cooper Cronk. I mean, something that comes to mind is he's the ultimate professional, but I don't know, he's just such a good player, so consistent. He's probably not someone who should have been as good as what he was, but just some hard work and determination, he got to where he was. I'll be honest, I didn't really see this retirement coming. It seems strange, but I thought he's been playing pretty good football. Hasn't had too many injuries. I know he got injured in the grand final and, oh sorry, the game before the grand final. Played the grand final injured, what a story, but um, apart from that, not too many injuries. And I thought with how the Roosters are going, they're kind of cruising this year. I thought he might have just played out this season and decided at the end of the year. Now I think Cooper Cronk will go down as a legend, predominantly a Melbourne Storm legend. I know he played for the Roosters at the end, but he's Melbourne Storm through and through. It's kind of crazy to think how good that Melbourne Storm team was back in the day. I mean, that 2006 to 2010 era when they had Billy Slater, they had Cooper Cronk, Greg Inglis, Cameron Smith, that was just your big four. Then you add in your Matt Kings and your Ryan Hoffmans and Israel Flowers, all those sort of players. That team was scary good. You can see why they were over the cap, that's for sure. Now, Kronk, he's obviously done it all in the game. He's won premierships, won State of Origin series. He won Delia. Wait, did he win a Delia? Hang on. A few moments later. Oh shit, two time Delia medal winner. He also won a Call of Churchill medal too. Okay, he really has done it all. I don't know, man. What a bloody player. It's kind of funny to think that when he first came into first grade, he was like a hooker, I think. I think Cameron Smith might have even been a halfback. They did the old switcheroo, and here we are. I think we can all agree that halfback's probably the most difficult position in rugby league, and the fact that Cooper Cronk wasn't a natural halfback and he's become as good as what he is, it just says it all about him. Now, I'll be honest, throughout all the years, I always thought Cooper Cronk was a little bit robotic. I thought he was a little bit predictable at times and that he was kind of carried by the team that he was in. But I think at the back end of his career, it's become very evident that that's not the case. I had question marks whether he could do it outside of Melbourne. He's gone to the Roosters and you can argue that they're easily the best team in the comp, but he's a big reason as to why they are easily the best team in the comp. And although he didn't do too much in the grand final, just the fact that he even got out there in the first place, it says a lot about Cooper Cronk as a player. I think him playing in the grand final definitely was a big plus for the Roosters, even though he didn't do a hell of a lot. Just the fact that he was there and able to sort of direct them around a lot. And I mean, even held his own in defense a little bit too. But yeah, Luke Curry was able to just do his thing, Tedesco do his thing, and they could just relax out there a little bit more knowing he's in the side. But yeah, I don't want to make this video go on for too long. I think we all know how good of a player Cooper Cronk is. I think the question when he retires will be, will he be an immortal? In my opinion, I probably wouldn't have him as an immortal if you're going to go with that whole immortal status of them being like the super, super, super elite. Very, very good player. Is he up into that caliber? I don't think so, but he's very close. Leave in the comment section below. Do you think Cooper Cronk should be an immortal? Also, leave in the comment section below what were your thoughts of his career in general. In my opinion, the guy could do it all. He could defend, he could attack, he could kick, he could do it all. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got to say about Cooper Cronk. What a career. Hopefully, you did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. It's on the screen right now. It's Mr. Luke on my T. Go ahead and add me on Snapchat as well. It's Mr. Luke on my T. It's on the screen as well. And to give my Facebook page a like. It's Mr. Luke. Just search it on Facebook. It should come up because I've been posting there a fair bit more. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Congratulations, Cooper Cronk, on a great career. Probably go out with a premiership this year as well to put the icing on the cake. So, yeah, thank you for watching. See you later, guys. Bye. Listen to me. Straight across. Zip it. Zip it. Zip it.